हेलो व्यूअर्स आई एम डॉक्टर विजय सिंह असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर इन बॉटनी माता गुजरी कॉलेज फतेहगढ़ साहब टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द प्रोसीजर फॉर पोलन जर्मिनेशन ऑन अ स्लाइड पोलिन इज बेसिकली ए सेल सिग्नलिंग द मेल गैमिट एसोसिएटेड विद रिप्रोडक्शन इन फ्लावरिंग प्लांट्स प्लांट रिलीज मिलियंस ऑफ पोलन ग्रेन्स एंड दिस फर्टिलाइज विद ओब्यूल और एग सेल टू फॉर्म ए जाइवोट एंड सब्सिक्वेंटली एन एम्ब्रियो these embryos represents the seed from which a new plant can develop so our today's topic is to study pollen germination on a slide learning objectives for this will be to prepare a temporary slide of germinating pollens to know about the various stages of germinating pollens learning outcome would be after this topic student will be able to prepare a temporary slide of germinating pollens understand the various stages of germinating pollens and know its significance theory of this experiment is first question arises what is pollination pollination is very important part of life cycle of a flowering plant pollination is transference of pollen grains from the anthers of flower to the stigma of the same or another flower mediated by abiotic or biotic means principle of this experiment is in nature pollen grain germinate on the compatible stigma of a carpel pollen grains can also be induced to germinate in synthetic medium during germination in time of pollen grain emerges out as pollen tube through one of the germ pore in exine that is outer wall the synthetic medium includes boron which is a micronutrient and required for pollen germination root modulation cell elongation and carbohydrate translocation second element required is calcium it helps in organization of mitotic spindles metabolism meristematic activity secondary message for some hormonal signal magnesium play key role in many cellular processes sucrose helps in formation of pollen tube next is requirement for this experiment a mature flower of china rose is collected the equipment required are glass rod glass slide dropper chemical requirement includes boric acid magnesium sulfate potassium nitrate sucrose and distilled water and fourth is preparing a slide for which the detailed procedure has been discussed procedure is divided into two parts first is preparation of medium pollen germinating medium is prepared by dissolving 10 g sucrose 10 mg boric acid 10 mg magnesium sulfate and 20 mg potassium nitrate in 100 ml of distilled water stir the solution with glass rod to mix it well second part include preparation of slide for studying pollen germination for this using a dropper take some nutrient solution and put two drops on a clean concave glass slide take a mature flower and dust a few pollen grains from its stamen onto the drop on the slide cover the slide with cover slip after 5 minutes place the glass slide on the stage of the compound microscope observe the slide through the microscope regularly for about half an hour observation first of all we need to know how pollen germinates in flowering plants however the ovules are contained within a hollow organ called the pistil and the pollen is deposited on the pistil's receptive surface that is stigma on the stigma the germination of pollen grains begins by absorption of water and nutrients and pollen grains produced a tiny pollen tube through a style to the ovary the tube cell enlarges and comes out of the pollen grain through one of the germ pores to to form a pollen tube 
the generative cell also passes into it it soon is divided into two male gametes these are some observation from the slides after half an hour uh, pollen tube comes out of the pollen grains through one of the germ pores after one hour pollen tube after two hours and a prolonged pollen tube after three hours can be observed conclusion pollen lands on the stigma where it hydrates germinates and extended tube that enters the transmitting tract the tube emerges into the septum and enters the micropyle opening of the ovule where it fertilizes with the egg and the central cell that's all about the topic thanks for watching video